For those of you who don't know, Dye is a 10 pound pom. In 1974, we arrived in Australia. There was mum, dad, and us five girls. We have to tell you that this was the best thing that they could have done for us. Had we not come to Australia, none of us would have met our long life partners. It's a shame Di took 14 years after meeting Sean to realise this. So there you go, Sean. I think I got the dates right anyway. up at this this wedding place all these young girls are there and here I am standing and the woman goes you got to get up on that pedestal I said beg your pardon and she goes get up on that pedestal and I went no I said oh, look I'm really old she goes you're still getting married so she didn't, didn't argue that I wasn't old but she, she said you're still getting married so I said thank you so um but anyway I got on that pedestal and they forgot about me and I was up there for 20 minutes mate <laughs> I got used to it no every dress fitting I, I was like and I go, can I stand on the pedestal? And they go, no, you don't have to. I said, no, I want to. So, yeah. Diane, I love you. You are my best friend. Today, I give myself to you in marriage. I promise to encourage and inspire you, to laugh with you, and to comfort you in times of sorrow and struggle. As I wandered on my lonely way along the path of life, I often wondered whom fate would send for me to be their wife. Since you came, our love was born. My path was made with you, my Sean. To thee I must my love entrust, and you in turn have treated just. So let us both give love and more, and today, we are one forevermore. Sean and Diane, by the authority vested in me, I have great pleasure in pronouncing you husband and wife. Sean, you may kiss your beautiful bride. <laughs> each other's drinks as usual and we are all to say cheers good health cheers good health all right